What's up YouTube? This is Cooking with Doug. I'm back again with my HSN Kitchen HQ. And this morning I'm going to make a late breakfast. I'm going to make some low carb pancakes. I bought this on Amazon guys. And later on, um, probably in the New Year's, I'm going to make it from scratch. I saw a recipe online where you can make this on scratch, but I already bought this so Figured, why not show you guys? Of course, we gotta check that out, guys. Five grams, um, two grams of fiber. All right. Got some sausages down. So we need eggs, heavy cream, unsalted butter or oil, and vanilla. I got that. Alright, so what you see here is one egg, one tablespoon of heavy cream, one teaspoon of um, avocado oil. It does call for coconut oil, but I don't have that. And then a half a teaspoon of vanilla. So now all I have to do is add one third cup of um, this dry mix. This is what it looks like inside. So this uses almond flour, by the way. Alright, I'm going to give it a mix. All right, guys, I gave it a little taste. Tastes good, but I'm gonna help it out with some of my Flavor Guide buttery cinnamon roll. Some of that in there. Check that out, guys. I put this on my chaffle one time and it, it made it taste fantastic, so I figured why not try it on this. Oh yeah, and when I make this from scratch next time, I definitely will be using that seasoning for sure all right guys let's go ahead turn this on i'm gonna bump it down to about 290 i don't want it too hot all right guys we are preheated i'm gonna hit it with some olive avocado oil just in case all right so the packet says do two tablespoons at a time, but I know that's just going to be too little, so we'll just make our own size. That's too small. Put some more in there. Hmm. A little more. Yeah, that size. So I'll be able to make like two, I guess. I'm not the best pancaker maker. <laughs> but we're not afraid to try. Oh, first one looks good. Oh, just a little more. Looking good so far. Not the best of flips, but we got it flipped. <laughs> All right, guys, I did the last amount in my bowl, which was about two tablespoons. So this is the serving size they would want you to have, which is like a mini pancake, which is cool. I wanted to show you that. All right, I guess we'll just ride out with some eggs.
Alright guys, I put some butter on my pancakes. I got this uh, low carb maple syrup. See that? Link will be in the description. So I'm just going to put some of that on there. Kind of messed up the top. It fell the other day. Well, the other week. So, got to be careful. Alright, so let me put that on top. And then get that on there. I just want to let you know that both both got uh, maple syrup and butter, so you don't have to wonder. <laughs> Shout out to my Kitchen Gadgets group on Facebook. Alright, there it is guys. This is my late 12.30 breakfast. <laughs> Chops and good. Didn't even need a knife. Just making sure, guys. Oh, yeah. It's nice and buttery soft. So, let's get some. Of course, you first. Legit. Does it taste exactly like pancakes? No. Does it taste good enough for me not to miss pancakes? Yes. This is good, y'all. Now, of course, with the maple syrup and the stuff that I added, the vanilla also gives it a good taste. I taste that in here. So, the directions say it's optional. I, I would say you need it. For sure. Absolutely. Let's get some of that ooey gooey stuff out of there. Let's mix that up in there. Yeah, yeah, which I know about that. Get that. Mm. It's too good. It's just too good. Alright, guys, so I'm gonna sit down and enjoy my late breakfast. But um I'll leave a link in the description to the Good Deeds Still Sweet uh, Low Carb Baking Mix, Baking Pancake Mix. Like I said, it tastes it tastes really good. Um, for low carb, hey, I would definitely try it. Now, there's definitely ways you can make it online. You'll need um, almond flour. There's plenty of recipes online. So if you don't want to buy it, you don't have to. And I'll also leave a link in the description to my maple syrup. And also to the flavor guide seasonings as well, because that's pretty cool. It's pure stuff, no carbs, all real stuff in there. All right. Also, guys, if you're on a low carb diet or low carb lifestyle like I am, consider joining my lower carb nation group on Facebook. Um, we'd love to see what you're making low carb. Uh, but if you need some ideas, you know, join the group, scroll down, and get inspired. Also, guys, if you have any type of indoor grill, whether it be a Ninja Foodie Grill or my Kitchen HQ or a Power Smokeless Grill or a George Foreman or a, a, a Curtis Stone Indoor Grill, whatever you got, um, if you have any one of those or any type of indoor grill, consider joining my indoor grilling group. We love to see what you're grilling indoors. You know, it's winter time, so let's get it popping. All right, if you got an Instagram, look me up on an Instagram, Cooking with Doug, but that's all I got. Hit like if you like it. Remember to subscribe. If anything, thanks for just even looking at my video, y'all. It's Cooking with Doug.